This is Code.org. I'm currently working on their CS Fundamentals course. I'm on Course D, Lesson 9, Fancy Shapes Using Nested Loops, Part 8. Use what you've learned to make this drawing. The squares each have 100 pixel sides and 90 degree angles. Okay, I'm going to start right there. 100 pixel sides. Joop. Oh, and we can only use one move forward in this. See, now it says zero. And 90 degree angles. Joop. All right, let's see if we draw something. We did. Good start. So now I'm going to need your user repeat because I can't use move forward again, but I'm going to ask the computer to run that four times. So I'm going to drop this here and let's test it. All right, we got a square. Now, what was this other stuff? And remember what this does, this pink thing around it says, run this code four times, computer. Move forward, turn left. Joop, joop. Move forward, turn left, four times. Once it runs four times, it would run code beneath it if there was any. You will need to turn 60 degrees each square. Why? Because there are six squares and 360 degrees. A full turn around. Divide six. Divide by six is six. Oh, yeah, 360. Yep. Okay, so we need to turn 60 degrees each square. And make sure you jump 50 pixels to get to the next square. All right. Let's try jumping 50 here, right? Because after we draw four sides, let's get to the next square. Jump 50. And I'm not sure if it's going to be left or right, but let's try moving. Well, wait a minute. This already says 60. Let's see if that looks okay. Let's try it out. Oh, I do look ready to draw the next one by turning 60 here. All right, now I need to do this six times. I can't use another move forward. So the only way I can do a repeat this is by putting all of this in a repeat. And I need to do it how many times? Well, six, we have six squares. I also wanna set a random color each time. So I'm gonna put this here. What's gonna happen now? When I hit run, the computer says, okay, run all of this code in between six times. So all of this needs to run six times. Set color random, it picks a color. It then says, oh, I need to run this four times. All right, move forward 100, turn left. Zoop, zoop. And then I start drawing the next side. Forward 100, left. Zoop, zoop. And the next side. And then the fourth side. Then it drops below and runs this. Now I need to move forward by 50 pixels, or jump forward by 50, and I jump. Then I turn right 60 degrees, I hit the bottom of the code, and it goes zoop, and says, oh, I need to draw another whole rectangle, a uh, square and runs this again six times. Let's test it out. This should do it though, I think. Yes, awesome. Loops are super important, so I'm glad we're getting the hang of it. Let's uh, keep going.